My name is Stefan Hinger. I'm with SIM. I'm also with uh, Vision 5.9. I'm currently the vice chairman. And as such, we are in the leadership of this uh, big network with uh, hundreds of organizations. Our uh, main focus is to reach those that are unreached for Christ. And so we have even a date by 2025. We want to see um, effective church planting in the different unreached people groups. As part of the steering team, I have seen how we work together. And sometimes it's very smooth. We enjoy that. But often uh, we have find some misunderstandings. And not always do we understand how they come about and why this is so. Recently, I have read a book. And this book by Aaron Meyer, The Culture Map, has helped me understand a little bit the differences we come from. Our cultural background play into how we communicate. Is it more from a low content or from a high content? Do we have to explain a lot or is it just as we say it is? How do you evaluate the negative feedback that we sometimes have to give? It's not that we despise somebody, but we have to share also about some issues and how we can do better. Is it direct like the Germans often? <laughs> or is it more indirect or we uh, don't say much about it? How do we persuade our argument is it like a principle that we bring and out of it flows then all the other things or is it more the application first? Um, how do we lead? Is it more the egalitarian, like everything is the same or do we have a hierarchical system? And that shapes, of course, our understanding on who we look to for maybe uh, some of the discussion and, and the guidance in our leadership as well. There's also trust. Do we trust because we have a task and we want to fulfill that task that God has given us? Or is it more that we work with relationships? Um, and we have this seen that we need to work and take time actually for a relationship as well. It's not just come to a meeting and work on the task, but really to, to work on our relationship and our trust there as well. Then, of course, how do we disagree? Is it a confrontational approach? Maybe sometimes... Well, especially as a German, that may be seen like that, or do we avoid that at all costs? And, and then we, we just leave eventually because we cannot work together anymore. And of course, time. Do we come on time or is time flexible? Is it more linear? What are these uh, uh, things that, that shape our meetings? And of course, if we don't understand where we come from, our differences in cultural background, we may actually not uh, always uh, work effectively together as a steering team. And so it is important, in my opinion, to really think about our cultural background and where we come from, but then again, see each person as he or she is, because it's just this love and the care for one another and for the, the reason for the network that brings us further and, and helps us by God's grace, of course.